December Premier League Player of the Month voting has now started and in this video we're going to be taking a look at all of the best nominees who's most likely going to be winning Premier League December Player of the Month and also when is it going to be coming out into FIFA 21 Ultimate Team as an SBC that we can complete, what is their rating, what could it look like and also their stats, which one would actually be best that we could get in Ultimate Team. So just before we get into it, if you guys are new here, here. Make sure you guys are definitely subscribed to this channel because I'm going to have lots more videos just like this one on future player of the months, Premier League, also the other leagues, the Bundesliga, La Liga, League Earn, if they do have some interesting months and also more content in the future, team of the year, everything you need to know about that. So just definitely make sure that you are subscribed to this channel so you do not miss out on any of those future videos. So getting straight into this one now, we did get a voting starting on December the 8th. So we do already expect that it is going to take a week or two for the SBC to get released. But just before we do get into that, taking a look at the nominees, of course, we do have Bruno Fernandes for the second month in a row. Possibly he could get in here and he would get a 92 rated card if he did win it again. He did have three goals in total in the month of December in the Premier League and also four assists and Manchester United, their form, it has actually been quite decent. They, of course, are to Towards the top of the table so they've definitely turned it around and Bruno Fernandes he's definitely changed the way Manchester United have been playing would some people be happy if he got it again a second time in a row I'm not really too sure he did also get a headliner so maybe in ultimate team it's not really the best card but in real life of course full argument towards Bruno Fernandes deserving to win Premier League player of the month and of course it is selected by the Premier League and also there is a small contribution from our public votes but that is just a very very small contribution contribution so even if we don't want Bruno Fernandes to get another ultimate team player of the month card it's just going to go down to the Premier League board if they think he was the best player in December in the whole of the Premier League then he is of course going to be getting another player of the month SBC but only time would tell if he is going to get it or not Marcus Rashford another Manchester United player he did actually have five goals in the whole month of December and also two assists so in total when you compare that to Bruno Fernandes it is actually very equal both did have seven goal contributions so that is very good on both of their sides so it's just going to be up to the Premier League board if they are going to be selecting a Manchester United player which one out of the two is it going to be they used to value goals a little bit more than assists but it depends now how it is going to have to be I do think it is going to be quite close between them but let's not write off all of the other cards as well all of the other players we do also have Mohamed Salah he did get himself six goals and two assists I don't really think that he's the favourite in this one. Liverpool, their form in the Premier League, it hasn't really been their best. So I would say probably a Manchester United player is more likely than a Liverpool player. But we do also have Suchek. This could be a really nice card. He could get quite a few votes maybe if people do want to switch up a little bit. They do want a little bit of a change. That would be, of course, that small impact though of the fan votes. I don't really think that is too significant. It is just largely going to be up to the Premier League vote. I really feel that our votes the community votes don't really have too much of a big of an impact but maybe it does influence it in some way let's at least hope but Thomas Suchek it could be a really nice card he should get an 87 rated player of the month if he was to win which is actually a huge upgrade from his base other cards so we do also have El Ghazi I would say he's the last nominee that does have a very strong chance of getting in here he did actually have very very good performances with Aston Villa and I definitely think he is a nominee and a lot of people might be voting for him as well. So when is the Premier League November Player of the Month actually going to be released into FIFA 21 Ultimate Team? We do know that last month, Player of the Month November, Bruno Fernandes, the 91 rated SBC that he did have, it's literally just about to expire when I'm recording this video. It is going to expire on the 11th on Monday. It is going to expire around in the morning, I do believe 10 a.m. UK time. So that is going to be happening. So of course, it does allow for another SBC to come in its place the voting did only start though on the 8th so maybe at least a week is what we do usually have to wait for the vote is probably going to close on the 15th of January and then usually a couple days a few days after that we do actually get the SBC so the earliest I would say we could get the SBC is maybe on the same day as voting closes on the 15th or around the 16th but more likely I do think it will be the 21st or the 22nd I wouldn't be surprised if it's somewhere in between there because it is 
forward, you don't really want to leave it too late. Then, of course, we're already going to be talking about the next January player of the month by the time we do get this SBC. But that usually is how we do get this. But we did get it around the 15th. That is when we did get last month's player of the month. So hopefully it is going to be around then. Maybe when voting closes, we might get it straight away around the 15th of January. But let me know down in the comments below. Who do you guys think does deserve to win? Should it be a Manchester United player? Bruno Fernandes, Marcus Rashford, possibly Mohamed Salah, Suchek? Or do you think it is going to be El Ghazi or possibly any of the other votes? Could it be John Stones, Martinez, someone like that? Let me know down in the comments below what you guys think. Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you next time.